It has been rainy and cloudy in the spring, but the depressing weather doesn't seem to ruin the fun at MIT's toy design class. Barry Kudowitz, an MIT PhD student researching on play and humor in idea generation, started the class five years ago, which has now become one of the most highly enrolled mechanic engineering classes. The class is made up of three parts. First is lecture. Students aren't allowed in until everything in the classroom is set up, music, name tags, and lots of toys. The class has about 80 students, and it's divided into groups. Today, they're discussing aesthetic and product design. <laughs> Who thinks this is cute? Woo. Everyone! <laughs> Why? It's, it's in our heads to think that is cute. We, we are programmed to see a little baby and say, oh, I'm going to take care of you. That's how we survive. If babies look like, like poo, you'd be like, eh. We have very few more people in this world. But no, they're cute and adorable, and that's why the really cute dogs have evolved. Anyway. <laughs> and that's what they do in products. So they incorporate cute, and they say, oh, I want to buy this. It has a face. <laughs> To fully enjoy the fun, students are required to arrive on time, and those who break the rule will get punished. This one, who has arrived late today, has to wear a silly hat throughout the entire lecture. Besides endless jokes and funny slideshows, there are also hands-on experiments. The jelly bean experiment aims to explore the relationship between taste and smell. I want you to hold your nose as quiet as you can. Start chewing the jelly bean. Before you swallow the jelly bean, at some point, I want you to let go of your nose. And as soon as you let go of your nose, then you'll be able to taste the actual flavor. Okay? The best part of the class is play testing held at the MIT Museum, where kids get to play with and destroy the toys students design. So you have these vests that have sensors, and whenever you sword fight and someone hits the sensor, then um, it goes off and makes a noise, and so that's how you can tell if you've lost a life. Bumperbot is a into things and run into stuff and have uh, uh, attachments fall off and uh, just play with it and have fun. And there's more. This is Flycatcher. Monkey Huster. And bubble frisbee, a soft and bouncy frisbee with a bubble blower attached to it. Finally, there is a lab section where students build or repair their toys and discuss how the play testing has gone. This group is discussing whether they can use gum flavored bubbles for their bubble frisbee. Oh, I, I love this class. Uh, it's great because we get to design our own toys and uh, get work in the lab and working in groups is fun and brainstorming for ideas. I, I, I love everything about it.